All right, so in this clip, let's now finally, we've got all of our piles, let's figure out, we've got to put it back into the closet or back into your walk-in closet like we've got in here, um, but what to hang and what not to hang up. So really, um, when you're going through everything, most things can be hung up. There's just the exception of a couple of things. So we're talking about your skirts can be hung up, whether they be separate or together. Your pants can be hung up, whether you're going to have them separate or on a hanger like this that uh, that you can get about five different pairs of pants on them. These are sometimes a pain, but some people really do like them. I don't mind them sometimes for a few things. Of course, uh, any of your blouses can be hung up, all of your blouses for that matter, and your t-shirts and everything. It basically comes down to what can't be hung up. And really, when we're talking about things that can't be hung up, it's the fine, delicate knits. The things that, if they go on a hanger, are going to sag the shoulders, especially with sweaters and those delicate knit products that, when you put them on a hanger, especially a wire hanger, you don't want to put it, uh, if you can really avoid wire hangers, that's a great thing, um, but you don't want that sagginess of the shoulder. And so, again, the knit items fundamentally are the big thing that you don't want to uh, to be hanging so you either want to have them folded you want to put them in a box they might go in your seasonal pile or uh, they're gonna they're the things that are gonna go on the shelving part of your closet